It is game six of the 4-5 matchup out west. Memphis trying to stave off elimination once again. Meanwhile, Chris Paul and the Clippers trying to close out the series. Both Blake Griffin and CP3 dealing with injuries, but they would play through it and be effective. We pick this one up midway through the first quarter off the miss, Zach Randolph outlets to Rudy Gay, and Gay drives in while getting fouled and scores. He would make the free throw, Memphis led 12 to eight. Back on the other end of the floor, Ron Butler, despite the broken hand, still playing well above the rim. That got the Clippers within three. Now Zach Randolph, outlets down toward Mike Conley, feeds Tony Allen, the tomahawk. And the Clippers are none too pleased with how Chris Paul and Blake Griffin did not get back on defense, allowing for the uncontested jam. Karan Butler, well, he left Blake Griffin know about it. Back on the other end of the floor, Chris Paul finds Kenyon Martin. He comes off the bench to score 10. Later in the second quarter, Marc Gasol cutting down the lane and finishing off the glass. 34-28. Memphis would build a nine-point advantage. Blake Griffin here over to Chris Paul. They respond with a three, cut the deficit to one. On to the third quarter, it is Zach Randolph. The step back, the big fella showing some range, 52-46. Now Randy Foy drives, no good. Rebounds, gets it to Blake Griffin, and he gets the dunk. Blake gets 17 points. Clippers down by four, still down by four. Marcus Gasol on the other end from Memphis. High arcing shot. Two of his 23, 58-52. Now Blake Griffin hits the floor. Look at the hustle points for the Clippers. DeAndre Jordan. That makes it a two-point game. Great effort by BG. Finds DeAndre. Now Chris Paul. The spot-up jumper. He had 11.7 assists and we're tied at 60 and 60. Out of the fourth quarter. Where the Clippers would go on a run. Eric Bledsoe. Clippers would be up by as many as eight with eight minutes to go. But here comes Memphis, another fourth quarter comeback in this series. Rudy Gay, the hoop and the foul to give him the lead. It would be 78-76 after the free throw, and the Grizzlies would be in control. Marcus Gasol over to Zach Randolph, 18 points, 16 rebounds for Zebo, and there will be a decisive game seven as Memphis wins it by two. Game 7 will be played Sunday in Memphis.